Hey, what's up everybody? Back once again with another video. This time I'm going to do an unboxing on a mask I ordered quite some time back. So it's supposed to be my uh, Chris Fenn uh, Liar uh, conversion mask, I should say, of the Spit It Out version. So, so uh, I can really not contain my excitement for this actually because I just got this uh, recently. So um, yeah, so I ordered this back from uh, I think Jared slipped my masks on Etsy uh, way back when, and he does some superb um, uh, Chris fans. Uh, he's done a self-titled, yeah, self-titled cover version, and recently uh, just specifically wanted this uh, a certain conversion from the Spit It Out music video, the mask from that, the Chris Fan mask from that. So, so I knew I was stoked for that, and I just got this now. So. And I gotta tell you, that's a really creepy mask. I mean, I've seen some conversions of it, and just seeing it in general kind of gives me the willies, which is why, you know, I really wanted to, uh, to buy it, obviously. So, uh, anyway, without further ado, I'm, uh, I think I might, uh, cut to this to, uh, the unboxing, so stay tuned for that. And, of course, I'm gonna do it in my own way. So. Freddy glove just to have some fun with. Oh, this is actually pretty good. <clears throat> Alright. <clears throat> oh, this looks pretty good, I should say. <laughs> I'm glad I got this Freddy glove out. I didn't cut anything, so... Alright, let's open... Alright, so let's see what's in here. Oh, that looks so beautiful. Man, this is much better than the... than the photos he sent me. I mean, it's a, it's a thing that, um... Jared, who did this conversion, um... He was sending me pictures of uh, this thing in progress, which I'm glad he did, because I was so stoked about it. I'm glad he took his time on it too, because uh, wow, this looks so amazing. Wow, this, that's just awesome, man. A really beautiful conversion. I mean, I'm just amazed. It looks way better than uh, the photos, that's for sure. So, uh, like I said, uh, definitely sent um, progress photos on my Etsy uh, messages, so on my account. And I'd say you did a pretty good job. Even the inside is amazing. It's really heavy too because of the buckles, but wow, this is awesome. <sighs> amazing, amazing. Alright, I think I'll have some, uh, I'll do a video of this, uh, of me wearing it, and uh, some photos, hopefully. So, or maybe just the video, whatever comes first. So, alright. Alright, so here's the mask out of the box. And uh, sorry about that uh, messy intro because it's just this mask kind of came when I uh, least expected. Because uh, I wasn't really expecting it for another week at least, but I mean it's here now, which is good. So um, I do have to catch up though because it's kind of been uh, filmed quite some time ago. So, uh, but anyway, so here it is out of the box, and uh, I don't have the buckles on yet because I kind of want to uh, wear this thing just. Uh, show how it looks. Um, yeah, it's, you know, super freaky mask. Um, so, anyway, I got this from uh, Jared Slipknot Masks on Etsy. He started doing these uh, conversions. Which, uh, I know he's done one for, uh, I think, the album cover mask. Album cover liar, that's it. <clears throat> so, there's that, and there's also uh, this new Spit It Out one, which he was doing, so I uh, put out an order for that, and so, you know, sometimes came and went, and here it is, so, and a uh, really great guy to uh, Jared Slipknot Mass, I mean, he really um, sort of updated me along the way just to see how this thing was going and how the conversion was sort of taking form, so, so really interesting stuff, so, it's good, it's good, good stuff. Alright, it's really freaky mask with those little, 
eye holes. So uh, for sure I'd definitely like to get a, an album cover liar just to uh, complete this, but for now, it's just this one for now. So, and I tell you, Jared did a really amazing job on the straps, and uh, uh, just a quick thing, some of these rivets have uh, they kind of come out easily, but it's kind of easy to fix, just you can glue them on or whatever, I mean, I plan on doing that. <laughs> Um, yeah, aside from that, um, it's pretty spot on work, so it's pretty good, I'd say. So, there you have it. Alright, so on to wearing the mask. Alright, so I got the mask on. It's going to be rather quick just to show how well this thing fits. I tell you, this was a heck of a monster to put on because, man, this, this mask really spooks me out. <laughs> Especially with these tiny eyelids, but hey. <laughs> That's why I got it, so that's why I'm wearing it. <laughs> yeah, so I got my uh, Slipknot jumpsuit, uh, just to complete the look. Uh, it's, it's a MIG jumpsuit, number seven, but it's inaccurate, I know, but uh, it's the best I can do right now, so let's <laughs> see, uh, see how this looks. Well, anyway, so uh, yeah, definitely hit up uh, Jared Slipknot masks on Etsy to uh, wear yourself one of these masks. He's a uh, really terrifying beauty. Um, I think he's, he's had a, uh, yeah, like I said, an album cover wire and also this one. So uh, I don't know if he's still selling them, but uh, definitely keep an eye out for him just in case. So and uh, just like, really, really good with the conversion process so far, and and super happy with this mask. Yeah, so. Of course, this would probably fit a lot better on me if I had shorter hair, but you know, it's my best of hair, so. Uh, especially ideal if you have like a, a hood or something, so. Alright. Okay, guys, so. See y'all in the next one. Thanks for watching. And, uh. Alright, see you guys in the next one. Alright, sorry about that. Alright guys, just as a last minute thing, I uh, just wanted to show off this painting of uh, Chris Finn, suitably of course with the Spin It Out Liar Mask. I uh, just, just wanted to add this as a last minute thing because uh, I remember this was a painting that I just uh, fixed up recently. I mean, uh, it's not brand new, but yeah, just thought I'd dig it up and just uh, you know sort of end the review with this. Alright, so that's about it. And thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Right, peace out.